let us continue with the next dimension of business environment that is political environment political environment includes political conditions of a country such as general stability and peace in the country general stability means how frequent the government changes that means if uh, there is a provision in our constitution that if everything goes same then the there will be a change in government after every 5 year if it goes on it's okay if there is a frequent change then uh, it also affects the business peace in the country that how uh, is the relation bit, uh, with uh, other country as well as how is the relation of people within the country that if they are nice there is a peace the business will go smoothly if there are riots or some other kinds of problem then it will affect the business if there is a peace it will also affect the business but it will affect in the positive way and some specific attitudes of the elected government representatives so that is the main factor of political environment you have to learn these factors you have to understand these factors that because the significance of the political condition in business success lies in the predictability of business activities under stable political conditions that means if a businessman can predict businessman observes that there is a general stability uh then the business he she can take decisions regarding the business such business activities uh, where everything will go smoothly otherwise he has to take conditions decisions under the cases where the business condition political instability is there then business will uh, definitely affected with this instability as well as uh there is a change due to political unrest that if there is a government it makes some laws but when there is a change in the government it makes some laws opposite to the earlier one so it is going to affect the business sometimes it you feel that the government is a business oriented government it makes policies in the favor of businessman like nowadays you are observing that business has uh, government has changed the conditions for the uh, micro small and medium industries msme d enterprises ke liye that uh, business has uh, changed the loan conditions so it is a environment which affects the business like you can uh, observe that in 1991 the policy was made uh, for in uh, for the smooth running of a business for the um, increase or development of the business uh, but uska ek negative effect bhi tha ki indian companies was being affected so these are the few uh, elements which you can remember in short um, which will help you to identify the application based questions the same points the same words you will get there like constitution of a country prevailing political system degree of politicization of business De- degree of politicization of business means ki business jo high business class hai how how the politics is being related to that business like hamari uh, country mein ambani's mittals or be so many rich people they are also able to control the government as well as the government can interfere indirectly in their business in this way there are the mo- uh, lots of other factors you have to uh, learn in this way the next is legal environment the legal environment says that various laws passed by the government court judgments as well as administrative orders 
all that in a uh, legal environment includes various legislations that it means laws passed by the government orders issued by the authorities courts judgments and as well as their decisions so it is compulsory for the management of every enterprise to obey the laws of la land that that's why uh, there is a sometimes that uh, these while following these laws that uh, businessman has to take care of the items they are producing if they will not uh, follow these laws or the um, uh, elements given in this law it will be punishable for the business if you have observed that uh, in the uh, while there is a movie going on and someone is uh, taking alcohol or smoking the always nowadays there is a, a slide or wordings going on that cigarette smoking is injurious to health means aap ek movie dekh rahe hain aur movie mein that that character is taking consuming some cigarette or liquor then saath hi saath mein client bhi fir chalni shuru ho jati hai that consumption of this may injurious or it may affect the health इसी तरह से दट अल्कोहल की जब एडवर्टीजमेंट्स दैट इज प्रोहिबिटेड टू सम एक्सटेंट मैं ये नहीं कहूँगी कि अल्कोहल की एडवर्टीजमेंट्स नहीं है हैं बट इतनी फ्रीक्वेंट नहीं है टू सम एक्सटेंट दे आर बी प्रोहिबिटेड एंड वेन ए बिजनेस मैन इज सेलिंग दैट बेबी फूड तो इंस्ट्रक्शन की इज गिवन ऑन दैट पैकेट दैट मदर्स मिल्क इज बेस्ट इसी तरह से दैट वेरियस लॉज दे आर प्रिवेलिंग इन इंडिया लाइक फैक्ट्रीज एक्ट है वर्कमैन कॉम्पनसेशन एक्ट है तो फैक्ट्रीज एक्ट के एक बार बताऊँ तो फैक्ट्रीज एक्ट दे आर फोकसिंग इट एक्ट इट इज इट कांट बी बाइंड इन सिंगल लाइन बट एक चीज जो मुझे इमिडिएटली ध्यान में आ रही है दैट फैक्ट्री एक्ट स्टेट्स दैट कि हाउ मेनी आर्स ए वर्कर विल वर्क इन एन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन और आई मस्ट से दैट ए इट इज गिवन इन द फैक्ट्री एक्ट दैट हाउ मेनी आर्स ए वर्कर कैन वर्क इन द ऑर्गेनाइजेशन इफ Uh, he works beyond to that stated hours he she will be given a uh, compensation to uh, in addition to the salary so there are the lots of other things that where the some act will be uh, mentioned then uh, definitely you will um, identify that it is an legal environment now Uh, the next topic is related to that what is the economic environment in india then uh, to understand this topic let us understand the uh, meaning of demonetization so this uh, process you have seen uh, with uh, physically you have uh, observed this scene demonetization you better know you have experience of uh, this uh, demonetization Uh, on the november 8 2016 that uh, uh, indian government uh, uh, accidentally they uh, announced that uh, the 500 notes and 1000 notes were not uh, be considered as a legal currency and uh, due to that uh, 60% of the money in circulation was became valid and uh, while uh, it is some time was given that to convert uh, that one can uh, have a currency old currency can convert within that particular day now the question was why the government has to take this step the government has to take this step to curb the corruption or uh, high uh, demonetization notes for illegal activities especially that uh, wherever the government was feeling that there is a lots of accumulation of black money so um, for uh, removing these hurdles government has to take this step that um, 
to large denominations notes were uh, rupees 5000 500 and 1000 were demonetized from uh, immediate effect of november 8 and 2016 then what were the features of these demo, uh, demonetization that uh, the every country uh, uh, used to take uh, this concept of demonetization it is it seems a uh, better tax administration for tax administration purposes or uh, that uh, if government time to time government uh, make ch changes in such kind of currency then uh, black money um, is being uh, can be controlled as well as taxes evasion of taxes can also be controlled it is the best way by the government to administer the taxes and uh, channelize savings into formal financial system formal financial system means a proper jo economy ka system hai kisi tarah ka wo hoarding nahi black marketing nahi that uh, or cash less economy bhi banana hamara jo hai wo jab uh, pm modi was first introduced in uh, 2014 to um, he dreamt uh, ki jo indian economy ho digital economy hai hamara honi chahiye hamari to ek cashless इकोनॉमी बनाना भी उनका पर्पस था दैट्स वाई और तब से देखो हमने जो है वो हम डिजिटल पेमेंट्स पर शिफ्ट किया है तो इट इज ऑल अबाउट द फीचर्स ऑफ डिमोनेटाइजेशंस